Sinus infections are very common. Right? Right? They frequently will be first associated with a cough and cold that then tend to settle in with the sinuses. Most common areas are above the eye and below the nose and stuff. Um, right? It's common with a cough and cold to have a, a, a headache, but usually with a sinus infection, the headache is much worse. Usually the headache's worse when you bend over, like you're going to put your shoes on and you set up, because the fluid inside the sinuses sloshes around. Right? Um, while most cases of, of sinus infections are caused by viruses and allergies and do not require antibiotics in the urgent care, I don't necessarily know that right, without taking a, a culture. So I am almost always will prescribe the, the antibiotics just because I'm backed up in the wall and I want to make sure that this patient gets better. Um, but once starting on the antibiotics, the person should be better within uh, two to three days. If you're not, there's a good chance the reason was this probably was a virus to begin with and the antibiotics aren't going to be effective. Some of the best, most effective things are the over-the-counter things you need. Sometimes just getting into a warm shower and turning on all the hot water and letting the, and breathing in the steam will help unplug this, the, the thick mucus and it will drain. Um, using a cough syrup that's for, that thins the mucus, like Mucinex or Cheritocin or Robitussin will help also. Again, it thins out this phlegm and mucus, it'll drain out of the nose and you'll feel better. You know, uh, also using some Advil or Tylenol for headaches that, that cause with this is good. Decongestants um, um, like Sudafed or Afrin are good because again, that a lot of the pain from the sinus infection is due to the congestion. Um, both of those are over the counter. You don't need a prescription for them. A lot of times decongestants are actually kept behind the counter at the pharmacy. And so you may have, if you don't see what you want, you may need to uh, ask the pharmacist or the pharmacy tech for what you need and get their advice. Sometimes uh, sinus infections are called by allergies. How would you know the difference? Generally, with allergies, there's a lot more runny nose, a lot more sneezing, a lot more itchy nose and stuff. You also probably usually notice that it's it's worse when you're around whatever it is you're allergic to. Like fine most of the day until the cat comes and sits on your lap and then all of a sudden wham you've got it. If it's an allergy you should treat it with, with first start with the over-the-counter allergy medications like classic Claritin, Loratadine is a generic frame for that, or Zyrtec or Allegra. All of those used to be uh, prescription only medications and have such a good safety profile that after several years the government just let them go over the counter. And that's what most everybody uses. Allegra D is a, is a combination of Allegra plus a decongestant like Sudafed. Right? If you feel like you need that, you, you, you know, certainly try it. It's going to depend a lot on you know, what your, on a kind of an individual preference on just uh, you know, what works better for you.